Joining us in the studio right now, Jen Ansaldi and Terry O'Brien from the Valley Originals. How are you guys this morning? Great, Rob. Great. It's a beautiful day here in the Mount Washington Valley. And uh, so, of course, obviously, you're also from the J-Town Deli and from the Red Park Pub. But today, we're going to talk about the Valley Originals. And kind of, I think if you, uh, if you tune into uh, White Mountains today, you probably know what the Valley Originals are because uh, you get to, get to see all that food. Every commercial, I said they're going, oh, dead food. So, <laughs> so let's talk about what the Valley Originals is all about. It's a group of 24 independently owned and operated restaurants here in the Valley. We banded together how many years ago? Oh, back in 84? Yeah, my dad started it. And since then, we've just capitalized on the fact that together we have strength. And we have strength to give back to the community. Well, I think that's one of the things. And, you know, so let's just talk about, um, for you guys, um, it's great because everybody gets together. They're able to do some advertising and everything else. Um, but the, the giving back to the community, I think a lot of people might not realize how much the Valley Originals gives back to the community. Yeah. Well, the first thing that we realize is lately, people don't realize that the Valley Originals is actually a nonprofit. So hence, that's why we give back so much. That's one of the reasons we got together. So our actual structure is a nonprofit organization. And this past year, we're upwards over $200,000 just this past year with local members giving back to the community. That's amazing. Yeah. That's amazing. Um, and so what are some of the ways that you give back? Oh. Jen's friends. Jen's friends, starting point. So we give cash donations back to some people. Do Valley Originals, actually, each one member donates back a certain portion of gift certificates that then get pooled out to the community at large. Yeah. We provide food for certain events. Those are special events. Yeah. Um, just the Ham Arena, yeah. uh, the Kennard High. The youth programs, youth programs. there, every, everywhere. So, so it's so it's really it, and the nice thing is it's it's part of the valley. I mean, you yeah. guys are part of the valley. Obviously, the people who live in the valley are part of the valley too. Um, so it becomes one of those things that's this nice symbiotic relationship. Yeah. I guess we could we say we all made a conscious choice to keep all of our donations local. And yes, we have a lot of visitors that come into our restaurants and they spend money, but we needed to keep our money in the valley, helping valley people. And, and that's one of the great things. You've also, you brought some, because uh, in, in, people come up here and they're like, hey, I'm here in the Mount Washington Valley and I'm visiting. What's unique? What's special about the Mount Washington Valley? And there you go. Jen's pastries. <laughs> so we brought in uh, Jen. Chris is going to zoom in on them, <laughs> on, uh, on the pastries that, that Jen, you got up at like 3 o'clock this morning and baked these, yes, right? Yes, I did. So, uh, <laughs> so nice of you uh, to bring those into us today. Here, here, Chris, I just gained that. five pounds looking at it. Yeah, we'll, we'll they are really in. tasty. And, but it's uh, nice. The Valley Originals also offers everything from breakfast, lunch, and dinner, family to fine dining. So it's, it's a plethora of opportunity for you to take advantage of. There's no reason you would have to go anywhere else. So, so, and I think that's an important thing. It's, it's not just your, you know, big sit-down restaurant. Right. It's all of those. I mean, the J-Town Deli, which is, uh, you know, what, what are the hours for there, for example? Seven to six. Seven to six. So, uh, and then the Red Parka, huh? you're, you're open the other end of the spectrum. Yeah, yep. we serve on weekends. We serve till 10. And, uh, and Terry's there. <laughs> yep. <laughs> well, that's great. What are some of, what's some of the things you got planned coming up here for the Valley Originals? Oh, well, let's see. We have uh, the Bill Coke Festival. We're helping sponsor the Bill Coke Festival, which is coming up this weekend. And then we have every year we do a lodging and business partner event. So that'll be coming up in May. And then we're also supporting at the Kennett High School. Right. So that's we encourage people to do that. So we're reporting the Pro Start program, Kendra's yep. program at the high school, with the uh, Key Club students. And that event is March 30th. And it's $25 and a ticket. Right. Unbelievable. What these kids do between the culinary and the key, the key club. club, they serve everything. The food is phenomenal. So that'll be a fun act, fun activity to go to yes, too. Just absolutely. to see, uh, obviously, people from the community as well as the, the high school students that yeah. are there. So, so that's a that's a lot of fun. And then um, in the summer, I'm sure there's a lot of things that you add to your repertoire in the summer. We try to mostly sponsor events that come to us. So the summer events is the hill climb. We sponsor that as well. The sunrise from the observatory. 
So we sponsor that. So as far as a group goes, we don't necessarily collectively get together right. and sponsor things. We're just too busy to do that. So we pool our money to support these other events that are off, yeah. you know, that bring people to the community. Like, so. like the Red Parker Challenge Cup yep. race and the Downhill Tricycle Race. Yep. Love those events. Which is great. <laughs> so, so definitely, there's always there's always something fun, and we always talk about here on the show that there's always something fun going on in the Mount Washington Valley, and so of course the Valley Originals make it that much. Absolutely, that much better. I don't see the chain restaurants having as much fun as we do now. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. And um, you also do, one of the things that you, when you mentioned uh, about that is that you do specials, uh, what is it, every quarter where you can uh, oh, the, you can buy the gift certificates, oh, the gift gift certificates, certificates a little the, bit yep. cheaper? So all those, uh, yeah, so every quarter we have a gift certificate sale. usually starts at 6 a.m. in the morning and it's sold out by 6.02. I, I know, I never, I never, <laughs> it's always, I think about it at like 7 o'clock, I'm like, oh, I know I'm too late. And, <laughs> But uh, um, all the funds that go from that go back into our general pool in the nonprofit so that we can help do um, fundraisers and all those other things that we want to sponsor. So everybody contributes that money back into the organization. So I think that's an important thing to, to touch base on. So the stuff that you make during those sales, that's right. not money that's going back into your no. pockets. That's, that's going back into your funds that you can put back. So if yes. I were to buy four gift certificates, yep. so I'm getting great deals at my favorite restaurants, but I'm also helping the Mount Washington Valley. That's right. And the other thing that's nice about the Valley Originals is collectively we have over 600 employees. So inevitably, if you're gonna dine at one of the Valley Originals, you are supporting a neighbor, friend, or family. So it, it makes sense to do that. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. So uh, there you go. So you brought us pastries, so we're going to enjoy those. And uh, what should we finish up with? What, what words of wisdom do you want to finish up with this morning? I would tell everybody to unchain America. <laughs> That was, those are my dad's words. Unchain America. Don't eat in a place that's just like every place else that you go to at home. And, uh, and so it's one of the great things. So if people want to find out more about the Valley Originals, you have a couple of really neat flyers that you can pick up, both at restaurants and other uh, information booths, I guess yep, you would say, yep. which uh, give a great description. So looking at uh, this handy book here, there's a page dedicated to uh, each restaurant, um, including menu samples depending on what they put in here so a lot of information because that's always a question well i don't know where i want to eat tonight so so why not have one of these sitting in your uh you know desk drawer or whatever it is and then you pull it out and you go oh well, let's go here tonight or you can do you know like roulette you know you just flip the pages and, <laughs> and see where it goes oh look at that is where we're gonna eat tonight so that'd be a good way to do it and uh also what information can people get off the website they can get off um, upcoming sales, events, sponsorship, how to acquire a donation if they need one, um, what we look forward to, and who else we've supported in the Valley. So. And you can go on and you can see every restaurant on there. Yep. Oh, and we have um, full face value gift certificates available all the time. So another great gift if you wanted to, your anniversary, your birthday, you wanted to buy something for your employees, you can go online and buy a gift certificate good at any one of the Valley Original restaurants. And so that's a neat one, too, the yes. fact that you can get that. So then it's kind of like not saying, not committing somebody to a right. certain restaurant, yeah. um, but it's saying, hey, look at the option I have now. Yeah, great gifts. Amazing gifts. Yep. We sell a ton of those, so. I can imagine. People are catching on. Yeah. Well, Jen, Terry, thanks so much for coming by today, Thank of you. course. Thank you. And uh, check out the website, which is? TheValleyOriginals.com. So you got to throw in the the, because, you know, TheValleyOriginals.com and find out all that information. Or, you know, just keep it right here on uh, Channel 16. And you get to see Perfect. and find out. Like I say, I'm sure we'll, we'll run some more food commercials and we'll all sit here and we all go, that looks really good. <laughs> <laughs> thanks so much for coming by today. Thank you. Thank you, Rob. Thank you. And we'll be back here in a minute on White Mountains Today. Experience something original and flavorful in a unique setting. Experience a Valley Original Restaurant. The Mount Washington Valley is a one-of-a-kind destination. Valley Originals are one-of-a-kind restaurants, independently owned and operated, offering something special you can't find anywhere else. Here are just a few. Black Cap Grill is known for its casual elegance and highly original entrees and specials made from New England's freshest and healthiest locally sourced ingredients. Build your own burger or come in for a nightcap at their contemporary bar, located in North Conway Settlers Crossing. Cafe Noche is a little piece of Mexico in the Mount Washington Valley. They serve healthy meals that everyone will like 
in a comfortable setting at a price everyone can handle. Get simplicity, freshness, and flavor at Cafe Noche in Conway Village. The Darby Field Inn in Albany invites you to savor delicious food in their romantic Mountain View dining room or in cozy Littlefields Tavern. The menu features seasonal entrees prepared from local ingredients whenever possible, including herbs and vegetables from their own garden. Joseph's Spaghetti Shed has been serving up great Italian food and pizza for almost three decades. Joseph's is famous for homemade sauces from family recipes, plus original meatball and lasagna recipes, pizza, other Italian favorites, and fantastic home-baked bread. Located in Glen. Get a taste of the Mount Washington Valley at a Valley Original Restaurant. There are well over 20 restaurants in all. Look for the gold flag.